Okay, now welcome to the last stop on this tour bus To the top where I was told her work would lure us Sure enough, look where I'm headed The opposite direction of the life that I dreaded Yo YouTube, what's up? I'm Tim, he is AC, this is the Cash Killer and AC Sports Report. Your town, your team, your Philadelphia Phillies are the 2011 National League East champions, five years in a row. And by the way, I know we missed the Tigers winning the division, but from here on out, we're going to break down every team when they win the division, so you guys don't think we're homers, even though in this video, we probably will be. So, uh, AC... Man, I remember the days when we had guys like John Lieber on this team and Robert Person. How nice does it feel s seven or eight years later that we have won the division five times in a row? Dude, I don't even want to think about those people's names and how awful we were back back when we were like real little. But uh, it's just it's it's great to to watch this team. It's it's great to watch baseball this way. It's it's just unbelievable. Five straight. I mean, that's that's a great accomplishment. No matter any way you slice it, because the division championship in baseball is like it, it's a it's a huge deal. And people who watch baseball understand that. But like people who don't watch baseball, they don't understand how big of a deal it actually is. And to win five straight, I mean, your front office and your players and your fans got to be, you know, they got to be great. And everything is just awesome this year. Yeah, I mean, th when, when they were talking about this team in the off season, basically everything they said, except maybe Roy Oswalt being an elite pitcher, and he, he, I mean, he hasn't been necessarily awful, but he hasn't been up to that standard, has pretty much come true. Yeah, I mean, everyone was talking about, oh, maybe the pitching staff isn't going to live up to expectations. Well, you know what? It's surpassed expectations at this point. Yeah, it pretty much did. That's too... Two pitchers with an ERA under 235 and one with an ERA at like 270. I think you're in pretty good shape. Looking towards the playoffs, it's anything. It's World Series or bust for a team that has Halliday, Hamels, Lee, and uh, either Oswald or Worley. And then you got a lineup that features Chase Utley, Jimmy Rollins, Ryan Howard, Hunter Pence, Carlos Ruiz, Hopefully John Mayberry over Raul Banez, Shane Victorino. Oh, he did hit a grand slam tonight, and that was boss. Yeah, that was boss. He has his moments, and I'm a fair weather Raul Banez fan, and I was at that moment. But man, it feels great to be a Phillies fan right now. I really do feel bad for the people who are in the other situations. And the last thing I want people to think about us is that we're the type of fans who have been spoiled our whole lifetime. Because when me and AC first started watching baseball, when we were like 5, 4, 5, 3, whatever age, in like late 90s, early 2000s, the Phillies were a laughing stock of the MLB. Veterans Stadium was a shithole. And now they got one of the nicest stadiums in baseball. They got one of the highest payrolls, which was not how it was how, when it used to be. And I, I could have never seen anything this happen. I mean, I remember after the 2007 season ended, immediately going to MLB.com and buying the Phillies yearbook, buying a few NL East Champions shirts, thinking, man, I'm like 13, 12 years old. This has never happened. It might never happen again in my life. I better stock up now. And then when they won the World Series in 08, I'm like, I have definitely better stock up now because we're not going to be this spoiled for long. Five years, three, four, five years later, and the Phillies continue to make these runs. It's just incredible. And if you're a Phillies fan or a fan of a team that is in one of these tremendous runs, you cannot afford to miss games or anything like that because you might never get anything better than what you're getting now. It's important. It's an important time. I mean, it's like you said. It's it's World Series or best this year. Um, I mean, I hate I hate to throw this out there, but I don't know if there's a team out there that can really truly beat the Phillies talent wise. Maybe they give up a game, you know. Maybe they even give up a series. God forbid. But um, I mean, the way they looked all season has just been incredible, and that's that's not being a homer. That's the truth. Yeah, it really is, and I just found a picture Justin sent to me. Angry Yankees slash Angels fans. As a Phillies fan right now, it does not get any better than what we have now. 
Looking forward to the playoffs. You'll get all the best coverage here on the Cash Kelly and AC Sports Network.